Is it the end of the world as we know it or just a hacker's hoax? Orange County cable customers heard the ominous prediction on the air today that the world is going to end Saturday. Okay, call 9 Stacy Butler live in Lake Forest tonight. Stacy. Well, Lena and Jeff, we've all seen those warnings, the test of the emergency broadcast system flash across our TV screens. But it's what happened immediately after that that has many across Southern California shocked at what they saw. You were watching what flashed across some television screens in Southern California just after 11 o'clock this morning. Some heard what started as an emergency alert. And turned into a warning of the end of the world. This Irvine mom was shocked. Because I kind of questioned what it was and asked somebody else that was in the house, what do you think this is? I've never, never seen anything like this before. It was weird. She's not the only one. On YouTube, another Orange County woman posted the same bizarre emergency alert. And another viewer saw the alert seconds before the station returned to C-SPAN. Tonight on social media, hundreds are commenting on the end of the world prediction. One woman said, I saw it too. A woman who lives in West Hills said she saw it while watching a show on Time Warner Spectrum. From USA Today to online chat rooms, there's a lot of talk about this Saturday, September 23rd. Some conspiracy theorists are predicting on that date, a new planet is supposed to collide with the Earth. Something scientists say won't happen. A spokesperson at Cox told us today's alert wasn't an end times message at all. It was someone's mistake, possibly an Orange County radio station and maybe even a hacker. In a statement issued tonight, a spokesperson said the radio station that sent the alert didn't turn off their programming when the alert ended. For a short time, some heard programming that was on the radio. Now, some suspect that it may have been a well-known evangelical pastor. He does broadcast every day at 11 a.m., and he broadcasts from an Orange County radio station nearby. So it's possible that it was him. No one knows for sure. Cox and Spectrum don't know yet, but we will certainly find out more. And the big question is how his message, if it was him, ended up as part of an emergency alert today. That's the latest from Lake Forest. Back to you guys in the studio. All right, Stacy. Thank you.